Welcome back, and uh, first up this time, this is uh, the plug for the inner door frame, uh, left hand side, and that's been uh, fully glassed there. This was, I guess, um, Wednesday, that, that would happen, and then this is the other one, and just beginning on that one, so we've glassed in the little door frame uh, locks there. And uh, in the meantime, Jeff, in between, has been working on uh, sanding those winglets, so they're coming along there, and you can see, you know, they've got the nice sort of profile on there, so a little bit more work to do for those before we get to fly that again and here you can see the other the outside of the right hand one there so it's looking good eventually we'll paint up that model once we've got it all dialed in and so here's the uh, plugs for the uh, left and right uh, windows it's a rear end door windows those came out nice um, so the next step on those is to give them primer and a sanding and next up on the mill was the uh, fuselage, uh, sorry, the uh, front window uh, mold or plug, and so this is here with a three eighths of an inch flat end mill, just a shorty, um, just starting out there on uh, milling that. So those need to be pretty accurate because we're going to create glass from those, and we want the glass the glass gets sort of uh, vacuum molded, and so we don't want to have any sort of ripples or anything like that in the finished uh, mold. So the plug has to be really good. So it was a very small step over there and. Took a long time to run those to make sure they were nice and accurate. Um, but as you can see there, it's doing a pretty good job. And they came out uh, nicely, so we're happy with that. And next up, here's the uh, guys uh, working on that second uh, inner door frame uh, plug. So they lay down uh, some glass fabric, um, pour resin on it, use a squeegee or a brush to wet it down nicely and then just sort of squeegee the excess off. So that's how you basically do glassing. And the, the fabric we use is nice. It's not like regular old fiberglass where there's all strands and stuff. This is stuff is like a woven fabric. Um, there's the um, one of the window ones all sprayed up. Uh, here's that plug uh, that they just finished. And here we are further along with the uh, with that front window plug. And you can see there about almost three quarters of the way through. And this is a little further along in the week. Jeff's actually finished, or pretty much finished, these winglets now. Just need a little bit of cleanup. Um, but you see the rudders there turning. That one needs a little bit more work to get it to full deflection. Uh, but they came out nice. Of course, the actual full scale one won't have the rudders quite as big as that. We just didn't want to rehab, rehab to do the rudders for the when we change the winglet size of the model. There's the other one there. You can see that's full deflection. So they came out nicely. So possibly next week we'll be flying the model. Not much else to do on it. Just got to wait for a good day with weather and, and light winds. And there's the uh, front window plug. So that's all done. Came out nicely. And next up we're starting on the outer uh, door frame on the right hand side. So this is just the mill firing up here again doing the face cuts and as you can see there out with the shorty again the three quarter inch uh, flat end mill and it just starts off there and runs up each different surface there's a lot of tool pass for this one because there's uh, different surfaces there and there's the frame and then there's the, the hinge um, points and things like that and this is Devin um, doing some sanding there on one of those rear or side window plugs. And we've got, you know, both, as you saw earlier, there's both windows in one plug. So that had a coat of primer and then some guide coat and then sand it off. So there you can see uh, finishing off, or getting close to finishing off that first outer door frame and then the other one's all ready to go behind it. And after some hand sanding and another coat of primer, there's all the window plugs there. So three plugs for five windows. And this is just showing the finishing off here with the 3 eighths of an inch uh, round end mill cleaning up or carving out where those hinge points are in the doors uh, again for the right hand side plug here and you can see it's a pretty tight step over here I believe for this pass it was uh, 0.02 of an inch or 20 thousandths of an inch so it does a nice clean job there not really much to do after that's done 
And there's just a stand back view, you can see kind of what's going on. And again, the other one up there ready to go. And that's the finished product. So all the all the milling was done around the, the flange as well and cleaned up and the swarf cut's done um, for where, you know, the little indent is there for where the, the door mates to this. And so this will create a, an insert that will bolt into our roof um, plug or our roof mold and allow us to create the frames at the same time as we create the roof. And finally, here is the next one. So all that's left to do is the other one, exactly the same as the right hand one. So this is the left hand one and just starting up. So that's the update uh, for the rest of this week. So thanks for watching.